guys welcome back to my channel my name is beige if you're new here welcome don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up and comment down below before you leave today's video is going to be a tutorial on this beautiful wig this wig was sent to me from love me hair i'll have all of their information the promo codes and the direct links down below in the description box so the wig that i received is 22 inches it is a 7 by 6 hd lace closure wig the hair texture is loose body wave. Straight out of the package, the wig does come with these gorgeous curls and the lace closure does come pre-plucked and pre-bleached. The wig cap is a breathable cap that is stretchy. It has a silicone strip in the back. And because of its breathable cap design, you can have access to your scalp while wearing the wig. There are three combs, an adjustable strap, and a removable elastic band. So here's how the wig looks on a mannequin head. It comes with a left side part, but you are able to part the hair anywhere within the seven by six inches of lace. So let's comb through the hair just to see how these curls are looking. I do like the style of the wig with the left side part and the deep bangs. So I'm gonna to stick to the original style straight out of the package, but I'm just gonna put my twist on it. And for visual purposes, look how wide the amount of lace is in the front. Like that is a lot of lace that you have to work with. So your styling options can be endless with this because you get way more lace on this wig than you would with a four x four lace closure wig. So now I'm just grabbing two different colors of lace tint. The first color is the color of my foundation and I'll be spraying that on the under portion of the lace closure where my hairline is. And the second color is the color of my scalp and I'll be spraying that on the inner portion of the underside of the lace closure. I'm doing two different layers of each color of lace tint and then blow drying after each layer. So here's a better look at the hairline on the mannequin head. You have the option of plucking more hairs from here or you can leave it as it is and just install it um, straight as it is. But I did decide to pluck a little bit more hairs from the hairline just so that it could look a little bit more natural, especially because I know that I wanna style this wig with the right side of my hair going out of my face and I want it to look, you know, I want it to look good, y'all. I want it to look good. So that is the reason why I will be doing the beige method of zigzag plucking and parting to get rid of some of this extra density along the hairline and have everything look more gradual and natural. And here is the hairline before and the after. So now it's time for styling. I'm grabbing BioSilk Silk Infusion Hair Serum and I'm just going to apply that to the hair. And then I'll be grabbing a hair wax stick. This one is from Cara Care, and I'm applying that to the hairline and I'm just smoothing out the hairline um, so that the hair can look more polished and so that everything can lay and go in the direction that I want it to go into. In small sections, I'm just going to curl the hair and I'm curling it towards my face for more of a vintage Hollywood kind of wavy look. So I'm just gonna curl the right side of the wig going towards my face on the right side and the left side of the wig going towards my face on the left side. And now I am just spraying the hair with a hairspray from Chi. It is now time for install. So I'm grabbing a pair of scissors. I'm gonna cut the lace down the center. That is going to divide it into two different sections, which makes it easier to cut off the extra lace. Grabbing a pair of pinking shears, I'm gonna carefully follow the natural curvature of this lace closure to get rid of that extra lace. 
And for today's install, I am not using any type of glue or adhesive on the lace. So I'm just gonna put the wig on my head in its proper placement and then mess around with the baby hairs, put my head scarf on so that, you know, the wig can mold to my head. If you have made it this far into the video, hashtag scalp in the comment section. I'm just brushing through these waves just to make sure that everything is going in the right direction in the same direction and then I'm just going to curl it with my hands at the bottom and use a bobby pin to pin it down. Here's the finished look. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, don't forget to leave them down below in the comment section. Let's chat everything this wig, the lace, the closure. I'll have all of the information, the promo codes, and the direct links to this wig from Love Me Hair down below in the description box. So check in the description box for more information. And I can't wait to see you all in my next video. Bye, guys. Yeah, that's right. It's Bezos. I, I, I.